Hey, what's going on guys? Tim here again. Got another episode of Weaver Spotlight for you today. And before we get into the video, I want to give a big, big thank you to all my current Patreon patrons. Uh, you'll see them all listed here on screen. Guys, thank you so much for supporting my videos. I really, really appreciate it. And you guys, um, yeah, you're making a big difference for me. So that being said, let's get into the episode. Today we're looking at uh, Not Impressed. First of all, awesome screen name, of course. Uh, nice little play on words there. So uh, Not Impressed um, is uh, belongs to a weaver named Danny, Paracordist Danny. And um, yeah, he does some really great work. He's also um, been supporting me on Patreon for some time now. He's been one of my biggest supporters. So Danny, thank you so much for that. Um, I'm not doing this video just because of that. I'm doing it because, you know, Danny does great work and he posts some really nice photos on his Instagram feed. So um, it's been a little while since he posted something, but uh, maybe doing this video will encourage him to post a little more. But uh, yeah, he does really great work, takes some really nice photos. You can see here we've got some uh, watch strap done with the mated snake knot. And also, um, you can thank Danny for um, the mated snake knot tutorial on my channel because I saw one of his pictures and um, yeah, I noticed that knot. It looked really cool. So um, I figured I kind of did some research into it and did that video. So as you can see, he does um, a lot of lanyard work and whatnot. What's going on here? Oh, okay. There we go. Don't know what happened with that other picture. This is a really cool knot, actually. That is pretty awesome. I never. I'm not even sure how you tie that. I could probably take some time to figure it out, but that is nice. It's a what does it say? Square knot bracelet. Oh, huh, interesting. Okay, I'll have to do some research into that. So as you can see, um, he takes some very nice photos of his work. Some monkey fists here, some uh, lanyard work. Oh, and this um, this stitched snake knot here. This is a really awesome piece here. I guess it's a uh, well, it's a camera strap, which is really cool. Um, I saw this as well, and that gave me the um, inspiration to do the stitched snake knot um, adjustable snake knot bracelet. So that's really cool. And well, he's even got his, um, as you can see here, his own customized uh, not impressed charms, which is really nice. That is really cool. So again, more of his work. Oh, and here is the, what is this one? All oh, right, the snake knot bar. Yeah, that's the one that um, the photo I saw that uh, was really cool. And uh, I did some research into the snake knot bar, so. That's cool. And um, I believe these are breakaway lanyards. Oh, it's a necklace, but it's a breakaway kind of attachment, which is really cool. That's nice, too. Looks like this is a, a thin line sanctified. Thin blue line. These projects here are pretty interesting, too. Um, I believe these are done with a um, spool. Almost like, um, it's not knitting, but I forgot what the term is. But yeah, really nice work. Something maybe we can do in the future. And there's his awesome logo. Not impressed. It kind of looks like, uh, what's the what's the name of that weave? Oh, it's escaping me right now. If you uh, know which one I'm talking about, you can put it down in the comments. But yeah, so um, yeah, have a look and check out Danny's Instagram feed. Um, really nice guy. I've spoken to him through uh, personal mes uh, direct messages before. And yeah, he's a great guy, does some great photos and does some really solid work. So I hope he uh, gets back to posting a little more frequently because, uh, you know, he does post some pretty pictures. And yeah, so guys, I hope you enjoyed this uh, episode of Weaver Spotlight. Yeah, and Danny's only at uh, 1454 followers, so let's hope we can get him a little bit higher than that. Oh, and before we go, he does have an Etsy shop. So let's check that out real quick. So yeah, he does have products for sale. Um, and as you can see here, he does have things in stock. I'm sure he does these uh, made to order. So yeah, really cool. If uh, you feel like, you know, supporting his business and checking out some of his products, definitely check that out too. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed uh, this episode of Weaver Spotlight. If you have any suggestions on some uh, up and coming uh, paracordists and paracord weavers out there on Instagram that you think deserve a shout out, uh, please leave a comment down below. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next video.